heart was broken and I was saddened when I got here. Parishioners are assessing the damage after a fire at the First Episcopal Church in Fairfield this morning. CBS 42 News reporter Matt Fernandez joins us now in the studio. And Matt, church is a busy place, especially at Christmas. What's their plan for the holiday? Sure, that's right. Well, the good news is the sanctuary did not have any damage, but where they have dinners and other events did have extensive damage. A big plume of smoke could be seen on Lloyd Nolan Parkway late this morning. The smoke was coming out the top of the, um, the roof and stuff like that and on the side of the building. And it's kind of sad. Fairfield Fire Chief Kevin Sutton said there was damage to the kitchen area and the meeting room. The kitchen was just built and everything. Brand new, brand new kitchen. kitchen. Brand new kitchen. This is where we get together and share and have good fun and good food to eat. The church had big plans for a Christmas meal in the meeting area. They still plan to have it, but now in a different part of the church. The sanctuary where services are held was not damaged. But I thank God that they did stop it from going to the next building and to the next building. The church means a lot to its members, and they're glad they can continue services. I enjoy it. I enjoy the, the members in the church. I enjoy the location. I enjoy the service. Son says they're looking around the kitchen area for a point of origin. And Fire Chief Kevin Sutton says the fire does not appear to be suspicious. Christmas services will be continued as planned. Reporting live in the studio, Matt Fernandez, CBS 42 News. That's a good